What's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. Hi, how are ya? Happy New Year! Oh my god, girl, it's been a minute. It's been a while. Now, always in the month of December when the year is winding down, I go into hibernation, I recharge. It's hard being the sickening all the time. <laughs> but listen, you guys know that 2021, there was a lot of major changes. I moved out of California, a lot happened, and I can't believe we're going on year three of the pandemic. Like, it's, it's crazy. There has been so much happening. And the good news is, I've been vlogging. Yes, I have been secretly vlogging for months. I haven't been lazy. You guys know I am, my work ethic is crazy. I am obsessed with work and there's been a lot happening. Last year, so much happened. I started several new businesses. I opened up a fulfillment center here in Casper, Wyoming, which is called Scorpio Logistics. It's been amazing and business has really taken off. So thank you for all the support. Um, it officially ships all the items on jeffreestar.com um, and all the Star Lounge stuff. So it's been really cool to shift gears and open up things out here um, and it's working. It's always scary to open up a new business. It doesn't matter how successful you've been in the past, it's always scary. So that's been crazy. And then in November, I launched Jeffree Star Pets. It was a dream of mine to create a pet line and we're gonna dive into that in a minute. I've been filming a lot of stuff, but it was crazy and life has just been a roller coaster. What's new? I know we can all relate to that. So it's 2022. What do we have in store? What the f is going on with this YouTube channel? <laughs> so officially, Christian's back. Hi, Chris. Hi. <laughs> Chris is back behind the camera, and we have a lot of videos coming and a lot of content. So of course, we're here in the beautiful state of Wyoming at the Star Yak Ranch. Now, that was a really big question. Jeffrey, where is all the videos on the ranch? Now, I gotta be really, really transparent with you guys. I kept it a secret for months. I was just doing me. I kind of turned off my phone. I know I barely uploaded and I really needed to have mental clarity. And I was going through a lot of stuff, a lot of growth, a lot of important stuff, all healthy and amazing by the way. But I needed to just kind of turn off all the noise. And I started a ranch and now I have almost mm, 95 yaks here in Casper, Wyoming. It's so crazy. It's been so amazing. So being a cosmetics mogul and a yak rancher, Imagine those two worlds combined. That's what this year is about. It is so amazing. Um, and there's a lot of questions. Jeffrey, where's Jeffrey Star Skin? I have the answers. Now, if you guys don't know, there's been a global supply chain demand. There's issues everywhere. If you've seen all the memes of the ports when it was Christmas time and there was a bunch of ports on the sea and the ocean, if you don't know what that means, basically a lot of us in the cosmetics industry, our packaging is made in other countries like Korea or China and then filled here in America. So of course my makeup is made in America, but a lot of the packaging does come from overseas, of course, like most companies. So we had a lot of issues. Everyone had supply chain issues. Even now, if you go to the grocery store, you may see empty shelves. So imagine how it affected businesses. So my amazing new company, Jeffree Star Skin, was supposed to launch last year. I know you guys know that. And I haven't addressed it yet. So we're addressing it. And it's crazy because I hate waiting. It has been the worst feeling ever to keep you guys waiting because I'm so proud of this company. And I've been working on these formulas for years. You guys know I've been so serious about skincare. I've reviewed it forever and it's time for me to launch my own. So get ready because hi, next month, it's finally coming out. Now I know a lot of you miss me doing makeup reviews. Oh baby, they're coming back. Now I know that beauty community has changed exponentially since I first sat down and did my very first makeup review. That was a long time ago. And for a while, I'm gonna be, you know, I'm always honest, right? Last year, it was awful. There was not a lot of movement in the beauty community. Jeffree Star Cosmetics launched a lot of stuff. Obviously brands were launching things, but overall the excitement of new launches, everything just felt like, ugh, I felt dead. I really felt dead inside. And I have missed playing with makeup. There has been a lot of actually, there's a lot of cool launches um, in the world and I can't wait to finally sit down again and review some makeup. So next week, get ready for that. Now on my vlogging journey, yes, I've been filming myself randomly for months. We have sliced it together. It's giving reality show, but it's cool because it's just me, very personal. Um, there's some confessionals, there's a lot of life stuff, and I just wanted to take you on a little more personal journey, if you will. So, grab a snack, grab a Red Bull, and let's get this show started. Did you guys hear that? You hear that? Say like, hello? Anyone out there? Hello? Nothing. This house is lonely. Hello! I know I've done that like 20 times, but like, I've been flying back and forth a lot 
first few times was really, really rough for me. Everyone left. We were working all day. I love to keep myself busy. You guys know I immerse myself in work and I just sat here in silence. And being alone is good. Silence is good. It's healthy. It's normal. Um, but no dogs, no animals, nothing. It just like really got to me psychologically. I felt like really lonely and I don't often feel like that at all. So I went downstairs and I sat in front of Diamond and Daddy's urns and I just sobbed for like an hour. Um, and I just needed to have a really good, I think, cry. And it's healthy, it's normal, but it was intense. <laughs> and I miss them so much still. And, and I don't know when I'm ever gonna upload this footage, but in a few days, it's Daddy's two year anniversary of not being here, um, of passing away. October 19, 2019. So a lot of thoughts of trauma resurfacing and just a lot of that in between working, flying, catching up on sleep, raising all the animals, um, fighting with mental peace, <laughs> and thoroughly like immersing myself as a rancher and I love it. But I'm also Jeffrey motherfucking star and this is me. And today we had a fucking amazing day. I love creating art and I love being on set, I love makeup, and I love transforming, and I love it all, I love the theatrics. So, it's October, I'm excited for the spooky season, I'm excited for Halloween, another year. Like, <laughs> it's just, I can't get over it for some reason. 2022 is around the corner, um, and I'm praying this house sells soon, and I can move on from this chapter, because the next one has already begun. Oof, bitch. I wish I looked like yesterday with the fucking mohawk wig. <laughs> but, mm, okay, so I have a confession. Since the car accident, today is the second time this has happened where I have slept weird and I have a pinched nerve. It, it is excruciating. Um, last time I was in Wyoming when this happened and Dane drove me to uh, my doctor. They gave me a cortis uh, cortisone lidocaine shot and it really helped um and the next day i was pretty much good this is awful um and because i'm supposed to get on an airplane in a few hours you guys like are you fucking kidding me i was gonna stay in la longer and i'm just sitting here in this big house hi no, and i'm like oh no girl uh-uh she's good we're out of here miss thing it's like my new merch that's okay. All right, you guys, say hi, Bill. What's up? Bill just helped fix my back. <laughs> um, I told everyone earlier how miserable I was, so I just got an amazing quick treatment, um, and we're off to the fucking airport. <sighs> oh my God. All right, Hidden Hills, until next time, you've been real. Oh my God, Bill, you're so sweet. <laughs> it's 45 minutes to the airport. We board in 45 minutes. And I think we're gonna make it. All right, let's get back to it. It's time to take a nap and get on the way to Casper. Um, not in Wyoming, not on the plane. <laughs> oh my God, I have my Tic Tacs. I have my new novel by Elvira, I love her. Um, I have my smart water and baby, this was my dinner and oh my God, today is just not my day, but you have to succumb to it. You just have to say, Hey, I don't think I was supposed to travel today. Who knows what would have happened, but everything went wrong today. Is it mercury retrograde? Do we believe in that? Um, is, <laughs> is it, I think it's just life being life. The power went out earlier. The internet went down 20 minutes before I uploaded, um, my Nordstrom video. Obviously I got it fixed, but, um, I obviously had the crazy uh, pinch in my nerve, which still sucks. Um, Bill helped a lot, but I'm still feeling some pain right here. And baby, I make it to the plane, I rush there, I barely make it through security, and I sit in my seat. And it gets really hot. And I'm like, okay, I'm, we're about to take off anyway. And then it gets hotter. And then the pilot comes on and he's like, hi, y'all ain't going. And I'm like, oh. Okay. The air conditioning just didn't work on the plane and the engine would not turn on. And I'm like, 
girl. <laughs> so they kicked us out of the plane and by the time that they rebooked the flight, um, not happening. So tomorrow they have the exact same flight and I am praying I will be able to make it. And then if, if that couldn't even get it any, any anno uh, more annoying, I get back here and I get a FaceTime from someone at the ranch. The Star Yak Ranch had another baby! Oh my fucking God. So, uh, Volcano was born on September 18th. Um, and now we have another baby on the ground. This is so crazy. So I'm just like, oh my God. And last time I landed and Snowflake gave birth and I was supposed to land today and a yak just gave birth. And I'm like, this is so cool. So I'm so sad that I cannot be there to meet the new baby. Um, Miss Goldilocks gave birth and Dane just sent me photos. They're so amazing. I'll throw up a few right here. Um, gagged. Dying, hi. <laughs> oh my God. Baby yaks are the fucking cutest. All right, here we go. <laughs> Hidden Hills, we love you. Oh, I'm ready, so let's pray we can make it. Uh, before. Sunset! I don't mind uh, taking the wheel. All right, y'all, it's time to go to the ranch! Goldilocks, they just went over there. Oh, hi, girl. What is this crazy light right now? <laughs> we just met the baby, they're out there, it's hard to see. We're gonna go a little closer right now and see if we can um, get a better look. <laughs> look at little Frosty in the headlights. Hi, Frosty. Hi, Gorge. I know, what are you doing in the light? <laughs> Hi, Two-Faced. Hi, Swiss Chocolate. Hi, Onyx. <gasps> Hi, Battlestar. Oh, there's the newborn! Hi, October! Mama is like, uh-uh. <laughs> All right, y'all, we'll see you in the morning. Good morning, everyone. It's about 6.30 in the morning. The sun is just rising, and baby, we gotta go check on some yaks. And if you didn't know, I'm Mr. Yak. <laughs> Me and Dana are about to go check on October. We can't find him um, on the telescope, so I'm like, we have a missing infant. Let's see, it's 6.30 in the morning. It's about mm, almost 37 degrees. Ah, uh, feels so good. I'm nice and bundled. She's bundled. And we're gonna go see if we can find October. Goldilocks has not been a good mommy, and she keeps leaving him, and we have to reunite them every morning. I'm like, girl. All right. Before we go find October, we gotta say hi to the mommies and all the bears in this pasture. I'm so used to calling my yaks <laughs> bears like the dogs. Toshi, hi mama. What are you doing? Snowy, hi mama. Hi Snowflake, what are you doing? Now that she's had her baby, she doesn't come up to me every morning. She'll let, she'll let us pet her, but she's like, I'm just doing me. Buster, come here boy. <laughs> Oh, Buster wants his head rubbed. Give me this horn. <laughs> Let me rub your ears, big boy. Okay, I hate the term I'm having anxiety, but I'm having anxiety. Um, Goldilocks, her baby's three days old. Can't find him. This happened on her second day. Woke up, she left the baby sleeping and was then searching all over for it. I'm like, girl, you left your baby. So we are on the hunt. Dane is in the general searching the full pasture perimeter. Yesterday we found her and brought her back to Goldilocks and she's doing it again. My battery on this camera is about to die and we have to find October! Goldie, where's your baby? They found October. <laughs> I'm so out of breath, okay. Um, he decided to go into another pasture that he's never been in before, and this is crazy. I thought he was dead or a coyote got him. And I've been sitting here like, you know, you always assume the worst. Well, I do sometimes, I'm fucking dark, so. He's alive. And we need to move the mommy because this keeps happening every morning now. He's only been alive for four days. <laughs> like, you fucking silly bitch.
Are y'all kidding me? My God, October, where have you been? Did he pee pee on you yet? Oh yeah. <laughs> Damn it, I want him to pee on me, you're so lucky. <laughs> look at his little hoof, show off his little hoofy. Uh -huh. Look at this man. Sweet boy. Oh, look at his face. Mm -hmm. You little escape artist. I know, and your mom keeps leaving you, just like mine did when I was little. <laughs> October. Look at those beautiful eyes. Hi, <laughs> boy. I know. We gotta go get you back to your mama. Your mama left you. Okay. Hey, Frosty. What are you doing? October. Where's your mama? She don't care about you, Pumpkin. I'm sorry. I'm sorry she don't care about you. I can relate. <laughs> it's the mama's boo-boo, though. Yeah. Sweet lamb chop. Look at this little baby. I know. Where's your mama? And we had to put the camera down for all that insaneness, but we got the baby and the golden together. <laughs> oh, and there they go off in the sunset. And she better be a good mommy or we're going to have to bottle feed, but... Thank God, a good ending. Okay, hi guys. Now, you guys have seen a tiny, tiny little piece of what's been going on in my life, but every other week I fly back from LA to Wyoming. I've also been traveling a lot. For New Year's, we went to Mexico. We had such a beautiful trip. I went to Hawaii for my birthday. Um, I shot some Jeffree Star campaigns in Dallas, Texas with Miss Jessie J. I've been all over the place. Um, and thank God, COVID free. I'm very safe and I really try to stay away from everyone, but you know that work does not stop. The grind does not stop. So as I'm sitting here, the booster's hitting, by the way, <laughs> the booster shot's hitting. But the journey, you guys, of my dogs going to LA, I want to show you that right now. It's really special to me. It was a really big moment for all of seven dogs and I to um, leave the mansion and get the hell out of there. So it was emotional. It was a beautiful ride. And then so many people have been asking me this, and I will answer every ranch question on the planet soon, um, but have the dogs met yaks? Any yaks? And finally, they did. For months, they hadn't. So I want to show you guys some clips of that, and it was really, really special to me. So look at all the babies. <laughs> They're ready for Wyoming. Diva, you ready to move? Diva's been a world traveler, and he is cleared to fly now that he has his vision bag, big man! <laughs> Diva! <laughs> they know what's happening. <laughs> shit, man, oh shit! <laughs> you guys, Diva has been through so much, and his cataracts, they're removed. He's been on extreme eye drops for what, you guys, two months? And it's been really intense, and the doctor said he's clear to fly, so Diva's moving! <laughs> It's crazy. 12 years ago, Diva was on the Vans Warp Tour in <laughs> a fucking tour bus, and now he's moving to Wyoming. All the babies are wildin'. <laughs> All right, it's time to get on the jet and get the fuck out of California. The dogs are officially leaving LA. It's really bittersweet for all of us. Oh, Diva. We are really leaving Hidden Hills. I've been ready. But just seeing the dogs. Look at drama. Look at Lishy. <laughs> Au revoir. Right, guys, we're about to take off. Diva, are you ready? <laughs> we're all in the jet. Um, and Casper, we'll see you. It's only a two hour flight. Thank God. We're so ready. All the babies are. Look at drama. Trust the jump down. Drama, we haven't taken off yet, lady. Look at Lish. <laughs> Hi, Dee. We got Vinci over there. We'll take him out in a second. <laughs> we could call him. Got two bears. <laughs> That's how we're doing it. All right, it's official. The dogs are out of California. Bittersweet, but so fucking cool. All right, we're leaving. Diva! Good morning, bears! <laughs> drama! Look at Drama on camera. Drama. Vinny! Oh, Vinch! Diva, Hi, Diva! Hi, bears! Come on, let's go! Drama, come on! Drama, come on! 
Hey, yaks. Let's go past this fence line. We'll go over there and say good morning to them all in a minute, but they're getting water. <laughs> Yesterday, I put the camera down. There was so much happening and I didn't film any of it, but the dogs, obviously they traveled really well. Um, they've traveled a lot before, so they did amazing on the jet. They're officially here. Have they met a yak yet? I know that's the number one question. No, they haven't. <laughs> um, they just saw some of the yaks walking far away and they were barking, but no dog has met a yak yet. So the star Pomeranians need to meet the star yak soon. We're gonna hopefully do it today. <laughs> um, and then later, in a few hours, I'm going on a road trip. I'm going to Crawford, Colorado, where there are several yak ranches. Um, and we're gonna go visit, absorb knowledge, meet some of the OG ranchers that have been doing this for 30 plus years and just get all their knowledge. And um, I'm just so excited. So let's get to yakking. Oh, look at who's with me. It's Dominic Tricks. Hi, honey. <laughs> Sleepyhead. We are gonna go um, meet a yak. <laughs> All right, Dommy. You ready to go meet someone? Okay, we got one of the yaks in the corral, so let's go uh, give it a whirl. Dommy, are you ready to meet a yak? <laughs> what do you think she's gonna uh, feel or think? I think she's gonna bark at first. You think? Or maybe just be really silent because like, they're uh, really massive. Yeah. All right, well, me and Uncle Colin are gonna go see. What happens? <laughs> oh, shit. We're going in the corral. These are big bears. <laughs> Hi, gorgeous. Where's Thunder? Oh, he's sleeping. What do you think she thinks? Oh, no. She's she not scared. scared. No, she's good. Hi, Thunder. Oh. Uh oh. She's barking. Are you growling, dummy? I'll watch. Are you okay, honey? Say hi. This is Thunder. She's like, what in the hell? <laughs> it's okay. It's a big baby, huh? Look, it's Thunder. Oh. I got the flies on you, boy. I got you. Be sniffing him. Hi, baby. Everyone will be hearing about Thunder soon. We did rescue him from a horrible petting zoo where he was being mistreated. So he's in the corral right now, healing. It's Thunder, baby. Look, Dommy, he's like you, but he has horns. I don't know, she's, she's so getting, curious. Yeah, she's getting she's curious She's sniffing. Now. I think he's, he's also not moving, he's being really sweet. Yeah, yeah he's a sleepy boy, huh? It's Thunder. <laughs> he, thought, he sounds like a uh, Jurassic Park like dinosaur. Yes. <laughs> Just a dinosaur. <laughs> it's him breathing, honey. Dommy's not sure. But you get to see a yak, honey. She wasn't too upset about it, but I want her to get used to the smells. Look. Dommy, it's a bunch of ladies. <laughs> Dommy's like, what the hell? Hi, girls. All right, Dommy, you met your first yak. What do you think? What do you think, honey? Do you guys want to smell your sister? Dommy, should we let him smell you? Is there you? Let's go. Where was your sister? Look at Dommy goes right back to playing. Let me see it. <laughs> and we're back. All right, you guys, this has been a really fun video, but it's time to wrap it up. It's getting dark and we're gonna be uploading a lot. We're back, me and Christian are excited. We're gonna be traveling a lot. Um, and yeah, how funny, first of all, how cute was Dommy meeting the yak? It was really special. 
Um, and it's been really, really beautiful out here. And I can't wait to show you guys everything, answer everyone's questions, and really just dive in deep. I've also been filming at the lab. You guys are gonna see the creation of skincare, all new products, new palettes, new, we have new everything, this girl. And 2022 is gonna be really, really full. So I'll see you guys next week. Love you so much. Mwah. <laughs> Bye guys.